final challenge about the qawama, the understanding of that concept will not be complete unless both husband and wife understand it that way. That who give the qawama is Allah Azza wa Jal. It's not the man who's appointing himself. It is not the woman who has to do that by herself. No, it is Allah who described the job description. Once we understand it that way, then everybody is rest assured that Allah chose what is best for me as a husband or what is best for you as a wife. So when you know that your husband is acting within the job description that Allah gave him, then you are settled. And when you know that you are acting within the job description that Allah gave you, then you will take care and have mercy on your wife. Once you do that, you complete each other. It is not about dictatorship. It is not about superiority or inferiority. It is about cooperation for the sake of Allah, in the word of Allah, in the name of Allah, seeking the reward of Allah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless your marriages. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa